I would like to show you how to link our Canvas site to the Pearson site. When you log on to our Canvas site, on the left side edge, you'll see the My Lab and Mastering button. Go ahead and select that. You'll note in the center, in the orange color, there is an open My Lab and Mastering button. Click that. This launches the Pearson registration page. If you have signed in for a Pearson account already, then you would just log in here. Most of us, however, will need to create a new Pearson account. Collect, select the Create button. Go ahead and put an email address there. I'm going to go ahead and select a personal email because if I put my Bakersfield College email there as a professor, it will not allow me to finish off the demonstration for you. But an email address is required and I would go ahead and um, use the email address as your username. It makes it a lot easier. Ooh, let's see, at least eight characters, one letter, one number, one capital letter. Do not use your username and do not use spaces or special characters. I had a special character. Let me try again. First name, last name, security question, my father's middle name, that's fine. His name was Dwight. Need to agree to the terms of use. And for most of you guys, you will not select the one or more of these applies to me. And then for myself, I would rather not receive a bunch of information on their products. I try to minimize my email. Let's go ahead and click Create Account. My Chrome wants to automatically save the password, and I don't let anybody else use my computer, so that works out well for me. Now that you're here, we have successfully created the Pearson account and we have to decide how we're going to go ahead and um, create our access. An access code would have came with a textbook if you purchased a brand new textbook. Of course, you can use a credit card or PayPal. Those are two options to go ahead and engage. If you don't have your credit card available, you can go ahead and select get temporary access without payment for 14 days. I'm going to select this option. It's asking us if we want access for 14 days and select yes. The Pearson count is then processing our order. All the information is available, so you have now linked into your Pearson account. Although this is what our Pearson account looks like through the Pearson website, we will be receiving all information through the Canvas website. If you have any questions, please let me know in the instructor forum.